Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you clicked on this video, this is how to approach the series introduction to the 15 days to lose belly fat workout challenge. Now, if you're doing this workout with me, if you are postpartum mama like me, which I am four months postpartum, uh, make sure you do not have the excess in rectal or not separation. If not, you're good to go. Also, make sure that you do not have any health problems, lower back pain issues, or any joint or muscle issues. Uh, if you do have it, get clearance from your doctor before you attempt to do these workouts. If not, I'm going to give you a gist of what these workouts are and how to approach the series. Um, so, what is this workout? So, this is a 7 to 10 minute moderate to high intensity workout designed to lose belly fat in the fastest way possible. So, there are some things that you need to do as well. Everything is not upon me or the trainer. You have to put on the work and you have to do some modifications as well. Modification number one is eat healthy. Do not eat any processed food. What is a processed food? Anything that comes in a packet is considered processed food. Now, also cut out your refined sugars. You can totally eat any naturally occurring sugars, any fruits, maple syrup, honey, raw honey, raw maple syrup, anything is fine. But if it is processed, give yourself a favor and cut that off your diet. This is not just for the 15 days. We are trying to make a lifestyle change here. I promise after 15 days, the habits you have learned from the series is going to take you a long way. So that was number one. Number two is take your measurements. Yes, please take your measurements. And when you take your measurement, do it first thing in the morning after your breakfast or after a meal or after even midway through the through the day you can feel really bloated and that might give false measurements so take the measurements first thing in the morning we are not perfect guys we are starting somewhere that's totally fine so take your measurements where you take your measurements take the measurements of the narrowest part of your hip um, of your belly and also around your belly button you can also take your hip measurements if you want but these two measurements are the most important measurements rule number three oh and by the way compare the measurements with when you start the program and it's 15 days after the workout same thing first thing in the morning around your belly button and also around the narrowest part of your of your belly rule number three is take pictures take a picture of yourself you do not have to strip yourself be in a bikini or something to to take a picture you can totally wear clothes but take a before picture and take after picture please 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 tag your progress um, on my instagram at am tom fitness results tag me at am tom fitness results so this is so important so that i can grow as a personal trainer and also invite other people to join this squad please rule number four is drink at least two liters of water and Check on your protein intake. Check on your protein intake if you're trying to lose weight. All right, so these are some of the rules uh, on to how to approach this series. If you have any questions, comment down below. Make sure you follow me on Instagram because I do everyday check-ins on my Instagram story at Anne underscore Maria underscore Tom. Hi. Also subscribe to this channel so you guys know every time that I upload a video. Turn the notification bell. Do not forget that. Click the notification bell. So as soon as this video goes up, my day one to 15 days to lose belly fat is coming up. Stay tuned for that. All right, let's get this workout going.